Thousands of students and more than a million dollars being spent. It is the formula for a national science competition going on right now in Augusta. The opening ceremonies for the National Science Olympiad Tournament just kicked off. And we are told that normally this kind of tournament is held in major cities like Washington, D.C. or Chicago. But this year it is being held in Augusta. In fact, the Convention and Visitors Bureau tells us tonight the 5,000 people it is bring could equal a million dollar payoff. Ariel Clay has more. Well, I'm from Pearl City, Hawaii. Yeah. Katrina Jimenez, her teammates and coaches made the 12 hour flight from Hawaii to Augusta to compete for a national title this weekend. It's this national competition for science students. The National Science Olympiad Tournament is being hosted by Augusta State University. Teams compete in a series of science challenges. Mamie Maccabee of the Augusta Convention and Visitors Bureau says thousands of out of towners are here for the event. 3,000 students into the area um, and with facilitators and parents included the, the number is more like 5,000. Of course a lot of people means a lot of money. Uh, the direct spending that we have estimated is about 1.7 million. To welcome this weekend's visitors and to encourage them to use local businesses, the Convention and Visitors Bureau hung up these signs all around downtown. Um, and then we also expect them to visit some of our attractions and be downtown in our restaurants. That's what Jimenez and her team have been doing. Uh, we toured in Fort Discovery and um, went to the Augusta Museum. So, what, what food have you had? The Waffle House. <laughs> Maccabee says they're counting on visitors taking what they see of Augusta this week back home with them. It's a chance to make an impression on some some other areas that we, you know, people that may not normally come to Augusta. What are you going to tell people about Augusta? Um, I'm going to tell them that they should come here because it's a really nice place and they should go to the Waffle House. <laughs> It is a very special Waffle House here in Augusta. By the way, the Olympiad is just one of this weekend's events that is expected to bring in some big bucks to Augusta. Overall, the Convention and Visitors Bureau expects about $3 million between now and Sunday. We should also let you know the NBC Augusta 26 weather team is a part of this year's Science Olympiad. And our chief meteorologist, Jeff Rucker, is the event supervisor for, of course, meteorology.